frequently hear employers, entrepreneurs and futurists saying that it's all about the skills and not about the degree. Entrepreneurs like Bill Gates or Mark Zuckerberg have a huge fortune, positions amongst the richest people in the world. Interestingly, both billionaires also dropped out of college prematurely. There are many more like these, in fact even those who had never been to any college. We know how many conflicting thoughts each one of us go through in our school and college. Do degrees really matter? Why do skills matter more than a degree? Is a university degree necessary for success? In this video, I'll give you the answer to all these doubts going on in your mind. Watch the complete video to find out what actually matters with me, Ferry Kumar. Some of the best known names in the tech, from Bill Gates to Larry Ellison to Steve Jobs, decided not to graduate and carry out an ordinary way. The reason for this is pretty simple. They understood that greatness and gold plate degrees don't always go together and it seems hard to argue with. They were confident and crazy enough to choose the difficult path and climb the ladder of success and reach the top. And now we all know their skills made all the difference, not a degree. Well, a degree can help us to earn a basic job and we can never grow without being skilled and seeing the current era, we know that the world is inclined towards ID. The future holds a very good place for those who possess enough skill set in the tech domain. It is the skill that employer get attractive with clients and time management which lifts or drops the person. The requirement of a degree depends upon a personal interest. In some situations, you may need it as an entry for a job. But with changing times and work from home culture, skills are much more in demand than just having a college degree. That doesn't mean you should throw it away if you have one. Degrees do have their benefits and we can't deny that. And these days, we have a trendy mantra, skills, not degrees. So it's not the skills at the exclusion of degrees. It's just expanding our perspective to go beyond degrees. So our primary focus should be to get the right set of skills. Now, there must be a question popping up in your mind. How do I demonstrate to the world that I possess specific skills and is capable of working and managing different tasks with or without holding a degree, whether in a corporate or freelancing world? The first is certifications and the second is projects. No matter whether you hold a degree or not, your ultimate focus should be on supplementing your current degree or knowledge with the right skill, as the companies are now sensing the pinch. For job openings, employers are no longer looking for white collar or blue collar workers, but instead new collar workers. An individual who develops the technical and soft skills needed to work in technology jobs through non-traditional educational paths. Instead, the new collar worker is trained through community colleges, software boot camps, professional certifications, technical certification programs, high school technical education, and on the job training as well as internships. Providentially, there are options to a traditional degree program that can help advance your knowledge and work experience. Getting such certifications will help you demonstrate your expertise and make you sound more credible. So from our today's discussion, we can conclude that formal education is falling behind. What employers now need is people with the right skills. It is the skill that helps the person to grow up both materially and financially, as well as concerning the status, importance, social respect, recognition, etc. We should overcome the hurdle of the skills gap that requires everyone to rethink advanced education. Let us know in the comment section the ways you are taking to upskill yourself. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to press the bell icon to stay tuned for more such job and interviewed oriented content. Thank you and bye bye.